That's got to be changed. And that's why Jesus said you must be born again. You must be converted. You must have a new beginning. And he can do it. How do you explain Jesus? Jesus Christ, are you what you say you are? You know, they only brought three charges against him to crucify him. One, they said, this man loves sinners. That was one charge. The second, he healed on the Sabbath day. And the third, he claimed to be the Son of God. Was he the Son of God? Look at his authority. Jesus came unto them and spake unto them, saying, All authority has been given to me. I know one thing. He forgave sin, and no prophet ever did that. Jesus himself forgave sin. He said, Thy sins are forgiven thee. I know that he had authority over nature. One day, he, one night, he was in a storm. The lightning was flashing, the thunder was roaring, the sea was raging, the wind was blowing, the disciples were afraid, and Jesus was asleep in the boat, and he stood up in the boat and said, Peace be still. The lightning quit its flashing, and the thunder quit its roaring, and the rain ceased to fall, and the wind quieted down, and the sea quieted down, and nature obeyed him. And our young people believe that today because one of their top tunes at the moment is, put your hand in the hand of the one who calmed the sea. He calmed the sea. He had power over nature. I was flying Cliff Barrows, and some of us were flying some time ago. I think we were leaving, we went a typhoon leaving the Philippines. And uh, just before we got out of the typhoon, I was the captain of the plane had invited me to sit up front with him. And it was fairly smooth. We had a lot of rain and all. It wasn't too rough. But all of a sudden, the plane hit something. It seemed to me as though it had hit a wall. It jolted and jerked and quivered and went up and down for about two minutes. And then all of a sudden, we plunged out into brilliant sunshine, into smooth air. And the captain turned to me with the perspiration coming down his face. He said, you know, he said, that was God telling us there's something up here more powerful than this airplane. But Jesus could take a storm like that and turn it around. He could take the lightning and throw it back in the cloud. He has power over nature. Why? Because he's the God of nature. Those are his laws. They're obeying him. He had authority over disease. I read uh, the other day where Mao Zedong in China claims to have cured 80% of all the deaf people in China. And one of those men that came back on the ping pong team said that Mao Zedong is the Jesus Christ of China today. They talk about personality cult. Looks like to me they've got quite a personality over there. But Jesus did make the blind to see. He made the deaf to hear. He made the dumb to talk. He raised the dead. According to the record, he had authority over demons. You say, Billy, do you believe in demons? I surely do.